Tesla Model 3 in detail. The Model 3 was codenamed Tesla Blue Star in the original business plan in 2007. An intended name of Model E was not used owing to Ford's trademark for an electric vehicle expected to be released by Ford in early 2019. It was announced on Musk's Twitter account on July 16, 2014. Welcome to Disruptive Age Channel. Today, we'll look into all the necessary deeds about the Tesla Model 3. Kindly subscribe and turn on post notifications before we dive in. The Tesla Model 3 blends range, performance, and an unparalleled fast charging network in a way no other EV can match. Tesla has far fewer stores than any other makers have dealerships, and servicing in remote areas may be a challenge, but it remains the best value in EVs five years after its launch. That's how good it really is. The Model 3 has three versions, Standard Range Plus, EPA Range Rating 263 miles, Long Range AWD 353 miles, and Performance 315 miles. For 2021, some exterior chrome has changed to black. Wireless charging and power trunk lid are now standard. The special order $35,000 base model is gone. Cheapest is now $40,000. Prices have varied frequently this year. The Model 3 comes standard with a full glass roof and a 15-inch center touchscreen display that controls most of the car's functions. Tesla claims 15 cubic feet of cargo volume split between trunks in the front, frunk, and rear. Tesla Model 3 has three keys. The first is a Tesla key card and can fit easily in your wallet. The second is your phone. You can set up to have your phone as a key in the Tesla mobile app. The phone setup is a key. You just walk up to the car and it'll unlock, or when you want to leave the car, just walk about five feet away and it'll lock automatically or you can go into the app, unlock or unlock the card there. Some other features in the app include opening the trunk or using Smart Summon, which brings the car to you. And the third is an actual Tesla key fob. It's a $150 accessory, which is shaped like a little Tesla Model 3. Model 3 has relatively few options, including paint colors, a non-black interior and wheel options for certain models. There's also the lifetime per month, full self-driving option, which has been promised now for several years, remains elusive and is not full self-driving. But the better version, workable though not final, is better than anything else, and new features arrive periodically through the car's cellular connection via over-the-air software updates, which the owner must accept to install. Connectivity or telematics via the cellular data connection comes standard and includes software updates and basic navigation. Premium connectivity includes satellite view maps and live view traffic info over cellular, music streaming, video streaming, and a web browser. There are four USB-C charge ports and two wireless phone charging pads. The Model 3 Standard Range Plus has partial premium audio with eight speakers and limited immersive sound. The Long Range and Performance Model 3s get six additional cabin speakers, plus a trunk mount subwoofer and full immersive sound. While its prices are higher than those of smaller, lower-range EVs on the market, the Model 3 stands alone in its combination of cost and range, even after five years. The first round of Tesla killers from European luxury makers have been lower in range and saddled with a confusing mix of inconsistent, fast-charging options on multiple networks some of which are far less numerous, less easy to use and less reliable than Tesla's superchargers. The Model 3's main competitor may be Tesla's own closely related Model Y, which offers most of the same specs and nearly the same range in a crossover utility vehicle package. 
The Chevrolet Bolt EV and EUV are both smaller hatchbacks that don't offer all-wheel drive and suffer from much slower fast charging rates. The same applies to the Nissan Leaf and various 2021 Hyundai and Kia EVs as well. The Model 3 was designed to be an affordable, battery-powered, compact electric sedan with a long driving range that mainstream consumers could buy for $35,000. Revealed in 2016 at Tesla's design studio in Hawthorne, California, the Model 3 entered production in 2017 using the company's new compact EV platform. The company reportedly received nearly 200,000 pre-orders. In the first 24 hours, reservations were open to the public. Manufactured at the company's factory in Fremont, California, the Model 3 was available in three trims long-range using rear-wheel drive, long-range using all-wheel drive, and performance. The Model 3 achieved an EPA estimated 220 miles from its 80-kilowatt battery, 75-kilowatt usable, and delivered up to 258 horsepower. The originally promoted $35,000 standard range variant using a 50 kilowatt battery capable of a 220 mile driving range didn't become available until 2019 and was discontinued in 2020. The standard range plus trim with a 240 mile driving range was added in 2019. The Model 3 was refreshed in 2021 and received an updated interior, minor styling changes and longer driving ranges. It's been a little bit overshadowed in the past year by some other cars in the Tesla lineup, like the Model S and the Model Y, but the good old Model 3 is still one of the best cars on the market and with some fresh new updates that are just starting to roll out worldwide. The Model 3 has managed to become an even more compelling vehicle and easily the most bang for your buck of an electric car on the market. The recent 2022 Tesla Model 3 is the smallest and most affordable offering from the California-based all-electric automaker. After a number of updates for 2021 that included an upgraded interior, increased range on a full charge and additional standard features. We don't expect any significant changes for 2022. Thank you for staying tuned. Remember to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications. See you next time.